Hey there, happy Monday. It's Ron with One Firefly. Thanks for reading our post and watching this video. Now on Friday, I sent out a, a video uh, informing you why we created our web maintenance program, and I promised to give you uh, some tips that you should implement every month in terms of updating and or keeping your website up to date. So I'm going to do that uh, today. So the top 10 updates you should be making to your website every month are, uh, number one, your website, your homepage probably has a slideshow or images on that homepage. You want to you wanna cycle those images over some uh, period, might be every month, might be every couple of months. But that way, if a visitor lands on your homepage, it's going to look original and thus it might spark their curiosity to check out other content on your website that may also have been updated. Uh, now, number two, uh, right below your uh, slideshow, if you're on a One Firefly site, you also have additional redirects and images. And so we recommend updating those and changing those around. You could keep the redirect going to the same page if you choose, but we could change the images uh, that are being shown there on the home page. So again, it looks fresh and original. Number three, the copy that is on that home page, uh, the, we often call it about us copy or what we do copy. You could keep that updated to make sure it's fresh and relevant and accurate for your business, uh, specifically dialing in or speaking to the, the particular customer type, whether that be residential or commercial that you're going after. Now, your homepage also often features video, so you could keep that video link updated. You could cycle through different manufacturer videos. If you're using uh, One Firefly engagement videos, you could cycle through those. If you're doing UI University videos, you could cycle through those. We also uh, would advise that you film original video content, and so get that new video content maybe per season. It uh, doesn't take hard. Here I am on a webcam and I'm shooting some video. You guys could do the same and uh, we'll take that content and update the videos or you should update those videos. Uh, number five, uh, at the bottom of the home page, there's a footer image. Uh, we'd advise that you change that image on some periodic basis, again, just to keep it fresh and original. Now, number six, uh, on your company page or your About Us page, you often have a header image. And uh, we would recommend changing that image to keep it fresh and original. Uh, number seven, uh, your, your awards, credentials, and industry memberships. As you go through the year, that is likely changing, and you want to make sure that that is updated. Uh, number eight, on your galleries, whether they're image galleries or project galleries, you want to keep those updated showing your latest projects. And here's a, an extra tip. If you're not photographing your projects or you don't have a plan to photograph your projects, change that. Stop. Restart. You need to be photographing your projects. That, that is uh, the best marketing asset that you have are the images from your projects. So you want to keep that content fresh uh, on your gallery. Keep in mind, we also you also could be using those images throughout your website uh, in order to keep it fresh and original. Uh, number nine, on your contact page, you want to make sure your, your address, your, your phone numbers are all accurate. That ties into the concept of NAP consistency, name, address, phone number, consistency. So you want to keep that up to date. You also want to update your Google Map location. If any locations have changed, uh, you want to keep Google Maps. Now, I'm going to give you uh, uh, some freebies now, so I'm actually going to go past 10. Uh, number 11, uh, any SEO in terms of if you've decided to go after additional uh, service uh, services or solutions and you've decided to target new markets, you could be updating your website with that new SEO information. Uh, now I'm going to talk about uh, security and safety in terms of a few more freebies here. So this is number 12. You want to be backing up your website at least every month. We recommend that you do it at least weekly. 
Uh, I've lost count here. I think I'm on 13. Uh, you want to update your CMS software for the latest version so that you are insured to be protected against uh, any security vulnerabilities that you might have. And then I'm going to give you a number 14. You want to be regularly looking at your uptime monitoring report. This is, A, you want to have that software loaded into your website, into your server, so that it's real-time able to give you the statistics regarding how often your website is down, if it's down at all. You want to know that so that you can ensure your visitors can check that out. Now, tomorrow I'm going to be releasing an additional video. I'm going to now start giving you the exact details relating to the new web maintenance service from One Firefly. We've been working very hard on this. This is, uh, we've been around now 10 years, so this is 10 years in uh, the making, and uh, this is our inaugural launch of our web maintenance program, and I'll have all those facts and details for you tomorrow. So please uh, leave a comment uh, on this blog. Let me know what you think. Tell us, tell me and my team if we're hitting the target. Uh, tell me if this advice was helpful for you, and uh, thanks again for watching. Take care.